Hello everyone. Today I'll be drawing up an idea I have to show. I'm going to show what kind of drinks, food we eat during the seasons. Because Halloween's up, and it's kind of soon, so I thought it'd be a good idea to at least express that kind of idea. So where we begin, we're going to begin with an idea circle, or an idea bubble in some ways. So I'll the concept of the drawing is imagine like it's imagine of, of a circle in a, cir a circle showing each part like four pies or pizza in some ways like four slices of pizza but more four slices of a donut but I gotta fix first okay I'll use the mouse for this one mouse number three and number four. Done. Okay, so the top one's gonna be spring. You can change it whatever you want. Let me change that. It's just gonna be spring. You can change it, you know, it does it's this small interpretation. The right's gonna be summer. The bottom, also known as fall, is autumn. Make sure I spell properly. Okay. And the left is winter. And the middle is just is the main idea, which I'll write down later. But first, when I think of spring, it's more like yeah, pancake day. What else? Tea slash warm drinks. Mostly just early spring, early summer, mid spring, rainy weather, a bit chilly but not cold. You could do your own kind of ideas if you want. If you have any ideas, you can write down in the comment below. See, suggest why I should have had. There's also one more thing. Oh yeah, with spring comes Easter. Can't forget about that. And then uh, that's about it, I can think of. Uh, summer, well, of course, cold drinks or ice drinks. Which is like sodas, cool lemonade, which also counts ice lollies. Or ice cream if you want. I said they're both good. And slushy. Which actually, when you think about it, an ice lolly is a slushy, just completely frozen. Because it's autumn, Halloween, of course. The actual whole entire day. Not just a candy part, but that we that will add later. Also pie, when I think of autumn. Also drinks, orange and apple. Either both or combining of both. Because you have the green leaves of apple. Or the orangey cow kind of changing of the leaves with orange. The kind of represents the kind of change of leaf colors with the drinks, and they taste delicious during that time. Perfectly ripe, but not rotten. And of course, don't forget, here comes the candy part. Okay, now winter. Well, you always got your Christmas dinner. Everyone wants a. Uh, yeah, turkey, chicken, or your own kind of variant, of course. But it's usually a big meal, so. Uh, what else goes with a big meal? Big dessert, such as cakes, and if you don't want that much, cookies. Well, with cookies, you also got your hot drinks, such as hot cocoa. Great thing to warm up those bones during, during Christmas. And the classic jingle that I always show during advertisements, the Coca-Cola bear. That's right. Coca-Cola itself when I think of winter. Now you got your ideas. It's simple. All you need to do is, is draw them. Just make sure if you have any ideas, write them down prior to drawing. You know, just more like brainstorming. Just try to get the ideas out. And I'll see you in the montage part. To start off, we made a bigger base compared to the prototype or the idea brainstorm. And now I'll start drawing the pancakes. For pancake day, of course. The colors I chose weren't really consistent at the beginning. And it was a bit too dark. 
not really pancake-like, and then I lighten the edge around it. It didn't seem well enough to be the color, so I just tried to paint the whole entire thing. Just a quick tip, if you're painting in this program, which is clear, I would recommend to be careful when you use a bucket tool, because sometimes the bucket tool will overlay the whole entire screen off that layer. The benefit of making extra layers is you can move each individual object as a single unit. Next was a cup, a standard cup, green top, that be more easy to understand as just simple tea, kind of, live. kind of a simple herbal tea for spring of course. But with the Easter egg, I started drawing the first one, and I was thinking we're, we're between two choices. Do I draw the classic Easter egg, a toy Easter egg, or do I draw the chocolate Easter egg? But technically the toy one could be a chocolate Easter egg, because technically they're both basic Kinder eggs. A chocolate egg inside the toy. Color-wise, I just chose a simple idea of a classic mid-color Easter egg design. Uh, now I, I decided I drew the second one, the chocolate. The inner shell, you would say. The inner shell of the chocolate is um, simple colored with a single outlier to show that it's been drawn on or shaken death in some ways. Next I'm drinking summer a little umbrella a little umbrella drink with a little ice cold drink of well cool it really right? uh, the lemon is just to give it more flavor or in some case make it more bougie but it does show the idea that it's summertime Lemon will melt due to the heat, or the juice will go into the glass, cooling it down, or at least giving it more flavor. The final straw is there. Next is the ice lolly. Simple, classic, square lolly, stick inside. It looks familiar to the old classic normal lollies, like the red one. You also got the rainbow one. But I just went blue, simple, blueberry cold um, ice lolly. Next is the slushy. The problem with the slushy is to make the slushy, you must convert the water. You might have different fl like colors because the top is gonna be more ice, the bottom is gonna be more colors. I would recommend fixing it because right now it looks like an ice bag. But maybe next time, when I do this, or when you do your one, a Halloween pumpkin, of course. One of your Halloween's everyone has. Everyone knows that Halloween's good with a pumpkin. Simple classic, easy and understandable. Good glow on the eyes, but. Right now we're going for simplicity. In your one you can make more highlighting, more depth into it. I would recommend it actually. Uh, the juice, orange and apple, the Halloween kind of look. I have a concussion of both, but an actual is just a hybrid drink. Chocolate simple, you sink kind of color, I thought it would be well. It's a chocolate egg, but I was if it needs to be a bit darker. To get more of a chocolate like actual chocolate bar kind of look. The sweet is the classic all Twizzle sweets, you should get a candy, you know, the cheap ones, but they're still good. Give that kind of preferably red, purple for Halloween, red is for the kind of like spookiness. No blood, it's white. Now we just have the purple. And next is Christmas. With the Christmas one, I just thought, do a simple cake, a bit of cookies, an old classic chocolate chip cookie, and uh, cocoa next to it, to represent that it's with the drink. The glass bowl. Ironically, it looks like a wine bowl, which can work in this sentiment because Christmas will be followed up by New Year. Same kind of concept, you know, drinking a wine bowl for good luck. But yeah, needs to fix it. I mean, if you're gonna do your one, make sure it looks like a bottle, not like my one. I mean, at the end of the day, I would recommend take your time, fix it, make sure it's clean, and Make sure you're happy with the product. But anyway, next is the turkey, or the chicken in this case. Classic old kind of chicken. Basic, easy to understand. Here's the ending results. It's simple, easy, spring, early day, summer, midday, Halloween, end of the day, okay, evening, and New Year's or nighttime, Christmas. See, that's why I put the sparklers, or the, I mean, the firework pretty simple I mean if I were to say I had more time I would make more detail fix up but 
this only took less than like two hours. Less than no, actually, it's been too generous. It was less like an hour and a half, roughly. But other than that, detail-wise, I like it. I like the idea for four seasons. The idea is you could do this with anything: cards, objects, ideas. Just put one sector as each, and do your own. And for now, thank you for watching. If you have any ideas, any comments, any suggestions, please write down in the comments below. And thanks for watching.